we can work out the one problem. A gets rupees 18,000 per month as salary. on the salary and DA at 10 percent of and DA at 10 percent of salary he is getting entertainment allowance he is getting entertainment elements or rupees 8000 per annum per annum during the previous year under 31st March 2020 That first March two thousand twenty, he received a bonus of three months' salary. He received a bonus He received a bonus of three months salary. He received a bonus of three months salary. He is also provided with a rent free house. Rent free house unfurnished house rent free un unfurnished house in a town. In a town. Population less than four lakhs. Four lakhs. Population less than four lakhs. Whose fair rent per month is whose fair rent? Rupees five thousand per month. Whose fair rent is rupees five thousand per month? Find out his income under the head salary. Find out his income from salary. Salary for the assessment year for the assessment year twenty twenty one two thousand twenty twenty one. This is a question.
Now let us work out this problem. Computation of taxable salary. Head, give the heading. This is the question. Computation of taxable salary. Assessment here. Assessment year 2021. This is the first problem which we are going to work out. A gets rupees 18,000 per month as salary. So you write that is basic salary. Basic salary. So you write salary. Eighteen thousand into twelve. How much it comes? Two lakh sixteen thousand. Basic salary two lakh sixteen thousand. Dear not servants. Dear not servants and pay. Dear not pay, it will be included in salary, but dear not servants will not be included in salary for uh, valuation, rent pay, accommodation, etc., etc. If it is not provided under terms of employment, but it is now for finding out the salary, you have to include it. Dear not servants, DA. How much? 10% of basic pay that is 2,16,000 that is 2,21,600 Dear Ms. Alavans 21,600 He is getting entertainment allowance rupees 8,000 per month Entertainment allowance that is that is not given per annum so you have to have not monthly so Annual entertainment allowance, entertainment allowance, 8,000. Oh, I'm sorry, uh, entertainment allowance, 8,000. He is provided with a rent free house. Ah, one thing I forgot, he is also given bonus equal to three months salary. So you write bonus. Three months salary that is 18,000 into three that is 54,000. Now value of rent free accommodation. We have to value the rent free accommodation. Value of rent free accommodation. Rent free accommodation. Here the house is situated at a place that is unfurnished accommodation where the population is less than 4 lakhs. So you have to take it as 7.5% of salary as the population for valuing rent free accommodation you have to take it as 7.5% of salary as the population is. Do you remember how to value the rent free accommodation? If the population exceeds 25 lakhs, it is 15% of salary. If the population is between 10 lakhs and 25 lakhs, it is it exceeds 10 lakhs but less than 25 lakhs, it is 10%. If it is less than 10 lakhs, it is 7.5%. Here, 
the fair rental value of the house is given it has no relevance at all that is only given to um, make confusion then students may take the fair rental value students may commit mistakes their purpose is only that fair rent uh, rent it has no significance now earlier it has significance now it has no significance now you have to see what is salary for the purpose of rent free accommodation the salary for rent free accommodation is salary alla definition of salary for rent free accommodation basic pay plus basic pay that is 2 lakh 16000 plus da will be included if only if provided under terms of employment but as simply da given so it will not be included da will not form part of salary for computation of rent free accommodation it shall be included only if it is provided under terms of employment it is not provided under terms of employment so hence it need not be included if it is dp no doubt you have to include da need not be included entertainment allowance when i told allowance i told you that taxable portion of allowance he is not a government employee then entertainment allowance will be fully taxable so how much is entertainment allowance 8000 plus bonus how much 3 months pay 54000 so how much will be salary for the purpose of rent free accommodation total salary comes 2 lakhs 78000 when you add these three you will be getting 2 lakhs and 78000 you have to take 7.5% of 2 lakhs 78000 7.5% of 2 lakhs and 78000 that comes how much 20850 i think you have you have on 20850 we have followed how to calculate the value of rent free accommodation here the population is less than here the population is less than 10 lakhs so 7.5% of the salary of the employee salary means basic salary plus da if provided under terms of employment but terms of employment will all provide it that is included dp plus commission plus bonus plus all taxable portion of allowances here da will not be included entertainment allowance and bonus will be included so it will work out to 2 lakhs and 78000 7.5% is 20850 20850 now when you add all these things you will get the gross salary how much will be the gross salary when you add all these things items you will get the gross salary as 320450 that is gross salary from the gross salary you have to allow the deductions under section 16 less do you remember what are which are the deductions that are allowed there are three deductions allowed which are the 161 section 16 1 subsection a standard deduction how much is the standard deduction standard deduction is 50000 then comes entertainment allowance entertainment allowance is applicable only in the case of government employees for government employees the deduction for entertainment allowance is actual amount received 150th salary or rupees 5000 whichever is less then tax on employment here he is a not a government employee he is not a government employee hence he is not eligible for deduction deduction kitana at eligibility illa only standard deduction shall be allowed standard deduction is how much less standard deduction standard deduction how much 50000 standard deduction is 50000 now tax on employment no employment tax is paid 
Hence, you are not allowed to get reduction for that. Hence, the only deduction is 50,000. So, how much will be the net salary? Net salary 2 lakh 70,450. 2 lakh 70,450. Now, we can work out one more problem from this. Mr. Is, X is employed in a factory. Mr. X is employed in a factory. Mr. X is employed in a factory owned by an individual. Individual on a monthly salary of rupees twenty thousand. Salary of rupees twenty thousand. In addition to the salary. He received bonus. He received bonus equal to two months pay. Equal to two months salary. equal to two months salary. The factory has provided the SSC with a rent free accommodation for unfurnished accommodation. The factory provided rent free unfurnished unfurnished accommodation. Unfurnished accommodation. The rent paid by the employer is rupees one thousand four hundred per month. The rent paid by the employer paid by the employer. Rupees one thousand four hundred per month. One of his son, one son is studying in USA. One son is studying in USA, and his expenses borne by the employer. And his expenses borne by the employer rupees fourteen thousand per annum. Rupees fourteen thousand per annum. He is provided with a small car. He is provided with a small car. Partly for private and official, partly for official purpose. Partly for private.
and partly for official purpose and partly for official purpose official purpose partly for um, uh, private and partly for official purpose all expenses in respect of the car paid by the factory all expenses in respect of the car provided by the factory are provided by the factory he is getting entertainment allowance at rupees 800 per month he is getting entertainment allowance rupees 800 per month rupees 800 per month find out the taxable income for the suspended year 2021 find out the taxable income for the assessment year 20 2020 year 2021 now let us work out computation of taxable salary computation of taxable salary assessment year 2021 let us see how salary is given monthly salary salary rupees 20000 per month so annual salary rupees 20000 per month that is 20000 into 12 2 40000 2 40000 2 40000 2 40000 2 40000 bonus 2 month salary Forty thousand. Bonus twenty thousand into two forty thousand. Now, he is provided with a rent-free for unfurnished accommodation. Value of rent-free unfurnished accommodation we can deal later. The rent paid by the employer rupees one thousand. One of his son is. studying in usa and his expenses borne by the employer amount to rupees he is also provided with a car one item we have to write he is getting entertainment allowance are the allowances okay them cash i take it them rupees 800 per month on over entertainment allowance eight hundred into twelve Nine thousand six hundred. Now, now we can value the rent-free house. The value of rent-free unfurnished accommodation. Value of rent-free unfurnished 
unfurnished accommodation. Please see, here the house is, here the house is not owned by the employer. He is provided with a, um, you see, the factory has provided us with a rent-free accommodation, the rent paid by the employer. That is, the house is not owned by the employer. When the house is taken on lease, what the rule? 15% of salary or the actual rent paid by the employer, whichever is less. Value of rent-free unfurnished accommodation is 15% of salary. Salary comes how much? Basic salary, bonus, entertainment, only these three items shall be included. That is 2,89,600. Salary for rent free accommodation two lakh forty thousand plus forty thousand plus nine thousand six hundred. How much it comes? Two lakh eighty nine thousand six hundred. Two lakh eighty nine thousand six hundred. Fifteen percent of that comes how much? 2,89,616% at revenue, 43,440, 43,440. Actual rent paid is how much? Rent paid, 1,400 into 12, 16,000. How much it comes? 16,800. If a house is not owned by the employer, a house is taken on lease selling a rented 15% of salary, but a salary ke you moon items a good to low, other 43,440 rent paid 16,800. Other value rent free, 16,800. Then, one of his, one son of us is studying in USA and his expenses are borne by the employer, which for the accounting year amounted to. Even day, his son is studying in, his son is studying in USA, education expense borne by the employer. What about that? That is exempted. Education expense of 1,000 rupees per month per child, that is exempted. If it, if it exceeds that, it is fully taxable. Then education expenses of son, it is fully taxable. Education expense of the child, uh, son of the employee, of Mr. X. That is actually, the exempted amount is 1,000 rupees per month up to a, per, uh, for one child. Exemplary amount is 1,000 rupees per month per child. So the total comes 12,000 rupees. Here it is 14,000. Hence the whole amount shall be chargeable to. Education expense, it is fully taxable. Now, value of motor car. What about car? Car is provided both for official as well as for pa partly for uh, private and partly for official purpose. It is a small car. Nothing is mentioned about Nothing is mentioned about the chauffeur. So only car is provided, chauffeur is not provided. Then value of car will be, as it is, if it is a big car, it is 2,400. Chauffeur is provided another 900. As it is a small car, it is 1,800 per month. For 12 months, it will be 21,600. Now we have taken all all the items. Now you will be getting gross salary. Gross salary. When you add all this, you will be getting 3,42,000. Now you have to deduct less. Standard deduction.
standard action how much is standard action 50000 balance is 292000 that is net salary net salary is 292000 so much about that